Hey you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for stopping by and watching this video. For those that do not know me, you should be knowing me by now. My name is Babalo and welcome to my YouTube channel. To the returning subscribers, hey honeys. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a what I eat in the morning. In the mornings where I'm just too lazy to make breakfast or I don't have time to make breakfast because I need to be at work or that basically is just me not having time to make breakfast and I need something quick and easy and nice and filling so I came across fruit sa on Instagram their website just was their page rather I was just like girl baby girl can you see us can you see us so um what I used to do was I used to buy mixed berries either pick and pay or Woolworth and it was pretty expensive it was not expensive but it was the same amount but a smaller quantity than what I got at fruit SA so um, I decided you know what let me just switch things up like you know let me get bigger for the same amount of money it only made sense I checked them on Facebook checked the comments people had good things to say about them and um, I really I honestly did not see any complaints and I'm not paid to say this I'm saying it because you know what this was my experience this is honestly like um, things that I saw on the page there were no complaints so I decided to order so I ordered um, a couple of things you know and I'm gonna show you guys right now so basically I'm gonna be making a smoothie and showing you guys how I do it and all of that so I have chai seeds I bought these at Discam. I did not buy from Fruit SA. I bought them at Discam, and I think they were less than 60 rands. They were less than 60 rands. Um, and uh, I'm not going to use them on today's video because you need to soak them before. Yeah, you need to soak them. There is a part where I read it actually that they need to be soaked. So I'm not going to use them for today's video, but I just wanted you to know that this is what I add on my smoothies basically. And this is my favorite, favorite yogurt. This is the vanilla flavor of the Pick and Pay brand. I really love it. Um, it's the only brand that makes sense to me right now. And I bought, I bought the... This is 1kg. This is 1kg. I don't know why I can see it, but this is the 1kg of the mixed berries. Basically, every berry that you can think of. Red berries, blueberries, strawberries. They are all in here. And I think this was 70 rands. I've already opened them because, I mean, I've been using them. And I thought, why not make a video out of this? I'm going to show you guys a clip of when I was unboxing on the next clip. Let me just put it right now so that you guys can see them. And then um, I have pineapples you know and mango when it comes to the mango the chucks are pretty big like they're very big so i'm gonna use all of them right now i have one i have another mixed berries that i have not opened in the fridge but these are the only ones that i'm gonna use you obviously need a strawberry cup i'm not gonna use this because that because it's pretty big and then you're obviously gonna need a blender to just blend everything together so guys they are legit and their website is pretty easy to navigate everything is just easy they do tell you when they will deliver so you are not even playing a guessing game of when you're gonna receive your order they delivered mine on Friday early in the morning they called me the driver was outside and I went to fetch my stuff and they were in a box and still frozen you know which is very nice so yeah, they do tell you if you're in Soweto, they deliver on this day. If you are in the West Train, they deliver on this day. So, which is very nice. Let's get into making the smoothie. So my order just arrived. <laughs> Super excited. Like my order just arrived and I've already opened it. Well, I've opened the box. And look at those, like, these are... berry blend sorry i got distracted by these kids outside it's strawberries blueberries raspberries and okay i bought two of those and then, um frozen mango and frozen pineapple can't wait, can't wait to use them. I'm probably gonna make a smoothie of pineapple and mango, but I'm just gonna add seeds. Yeah. Okay, so I've mixed 
my yogurt and my fruits on the blender I'm about to blend everything together Hey guys, so I am done making the smoothie. Shade is it's pretty thick. It's pretty thick. I usually use a straw, but then it actually tastes so good. This one is for my sister. I mean, this one for my sister. It tastes really nice. It's it's good. It's good. It's nice. So I hope you guys really like this video. If you wanna order from Fruit SA, I'm gonna leave their website link on the description box below. If you do order, do tell me what your experience was like. And I'll see you guys on another video. Bye.